so good to see you. Hey, if you're new to this channel, my name is Richard. I'm a high performance coach as well as an entrepreneur, and I make videos every single week on how to improve productivity and high performance. And I know I've made quite a few videos on the 5 a.m. morning routine, and the reason why I do so is because I really want to serve you and help you establish your own routine as well because it's completely changed my life. And so today, I'm just gonna be taking you through my morning, through the rest of my day, and I hope you can take those bits and pieces and start applying to your own life as well. Now, I just completed my first two hours of deep work in the morning. This is my protected time, which is no phone, there's no distractions, and I focus on building my business, right? So as a high-performance coach, I just finished last week season one of the high-performance training program. It's an eight-week coaching program in which it helps individuals in their high performance and their productivity, their time management, their mindset, and so many other things. And I'm actually preparing for the launch of season two, which is happening on June 20th, 2020. And so every single morning, I'm essentially crafting my product to make sure it's the best of the best because I always want to over deliver for my customers and students. One of my mentors, Joel Marion, he's on my whiteboard right there. He has taught me that you always want to over deliver for your customers, meaning how can you give 10X value? So if someone buys something from you and it's $100, how can you build the product so that it's actually worth a thousand to them so that your customer always gets more than they pay for? That's how I'm actually designing the high performance training program. Joel has built a company of over $100 million a year and he's been teaching me on how I can serve and impact as many people out there as possible. And so that's exactly what I'm doing. So today's actually gonna be really, really busy. My schedule is gonna be right there. So come on, let's go. I've been flipping pages since I could remember That told me I had to be within the lines of two degrees and nine to five And I've been working after work since last September working after work, yeah. I stay up late on the weekdays I never tell when we say Breakfast today is awesome as usual. I'm crushing half a chicken breast, getting my micronutrients with the blueberries and raspberries, getting peanuts, and I'm also trying a new thing. This is soy milk, unsweetened. I'm trying different kinds of ways to get extra sources of protein, and this actually had some pretty good protein in there while I'm not having to drink normal milk. My skin is kind of sensitive to lactose, and so I'm trying to cut off on milk products. So I'm gonna crush this meal right here, and then we're gonna jump right into work. So come on, let's get it. Take a chance. Hey, good morning. Hey, buddy. So I got to um, clear my schedule next week. I got to take a week off. That's why they're able to do such good numbers. So like the big thing is like conversion is everything. Alrighty, so the morning work session is done. It's time to get some punches in. So come on, let's get to the field. Mike's waiting on me. I've been flipping pages since I could remember. That told me I had to be within the lines of two degrees and nine to five. And I've been working after work since last September. Working after work, yeah. I stay up late on the weekdays. I never tell when we say. Alright, my friend. So last week I told you that. The legend has been training me on pads and he got a juggernaut suit and it's gonna be a body bag today, so let's have some fun. had an amazing, amazing Muay Thai training session with pads with Mike, and now it's time for a sales call. I'm running a little bit behind, so let's jump on the sales call. Come on. How you doing, sir? Good yourself. Are you fluent in French? Um, yeah, because it's my uh, it's my primary language. Yeah. Well, um, the only thing I know how to say is je ne comprends pas le français. <laughs> that's the only thing I know. But that's good if you don't understand the French. Yeah. <laughs> All 
Alright, so I have been pushing pretty, pretty hard since the morning in terms of getting work done, sales calls, crushed that really awesome white tie workout. So right now, it's time to enjoy lunch, take a quick 20 minute breather, and also have this awesome, awesome view, right? And <laughs> the crazy thing is, it's only 1.36 p.m. right now. It's still early, early afternoon. And pretty much all the most important tasks, I've already finished them. Why is that? Because when you focus on your hardest tasks first thing in the morning, and you do your deep work for that two, three hour block in the morning undistracted, that's where, oh my gosh, that's where the true magic happens. So, crush this food, let's have lunch. Man, had such an amazing, amazing lunch. And right now, I actually want to do the one minute shot clock, and this is where I answer one of your questions. So, if you have a question that you'd like for me to answer, go ahead and type high performance question in the comments below, and I'd be happy to pick your question. Now, this week's question I actually have on the computer screen is from Yunman Choi. And the question goes high performance question, what is the one thing you always tell yourself when you're not motivated or tired or lazy? And I'll be really honest and I'll be vulnerable with you today. Last night, I was catching up with one of my good friends, a very successful entrepreneur named Kevin, and I had so many many ideas in my head I couldn't fall asleep last night and because I couldn't fall asleep this morning I woke up and I was not motivated at all to pick up a camera light up my mood and start recording a video for you but I still did and here's the reason why. Whenever I get tired, whenever I am not motivated or lazy, which is inevitable, it will happen, I tell myself, Richard, you do realize that when you're lazy and you don't take action, you're actually being selfish because your business actually changes people's lives. Your work changes people's lives. Your impact through your YouTube channel could actually inspire someone else. So by you being lazy, you being not motivated, you not taking action, you're actually being selfish because you're not serving another person. I tell myself, how how many people out there are suffering every single day because of something that I'm not willing to do? If I don't build a business that does seven figures, then I can't donate on a massive level to that charity that I really care about. I can't give to the church the way that I want to give to my church, right? I cannot create the impact that I truly desire and that pain, that pain of helplessness of not being able to give, that's what fuels my fire every single day. Beautiful I really encourage you, find some kind of pain, find some kind of reason why you need to get up every single day because if you don't, what if someone else suffers because you're not making the impact that God made you to? So Yunman, I hope that answers your question. I'm so glad you asked this because in the high performance training program, which is my eight week high performance coaching program, I actually help individuals on this kind of mindset in addition to productivity and time management. I'm gonna put on the screen right now all of the different kinds of success stories I've had. You see Newton, he's a 23 year old entrepreneur who saved over 12 hours per week with the strategies that I've showed him. Another one of our students, Manohar, he had a really strong addiction to YouTube and gaming. He saved 30 hours a week. He's one of our students from India. Mitchell, a star star high school student within our program in the States has saved 25 hours a week. And the success stories speak for themselves. Veronica, I'm gonna put right there. Look at all the hours she saved. And as well as Gabriel. Gabriel is a university student, a high performing entrepreneur, as well as a model with over 50,000 followers on Instagram in my program. And he has saved over 18 hours per week with the strategies that I taught him. So look, I don't know if you're struggling with personal development, I don't know if you're struggling in your mindset or you just want to become more high performance. But season two of the high performance training program is actually launching on June 20th, 2020. That's a Saturday at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to be hosting a free live masterclass in which I'm going to be sharing with you the three secrets of how to double your productivity while shaving off 12.5 hours of your work week. It's completely free for you to attend. And at the end of that masterclass, I'm also gonna open up a few spots to join the high performance training program. And one thing that I'm actually only gonna be giving to the individuals that attend this free masterclass is a very, very special high performance planner actually from my coaching program. This is something that people pay a lot of money for. It took me thousands of dollars of attending different kinds of high performance entrepreneur workshops to formulate this. And I'm actually gonna be giving this to you for absolutely free if you show up to the masterclass. That's all you gotta do. And then on the back side, this is actually the exact schedule my exact schedule and routine that I use day by day. I'm gonna show you exactly how to structure out your day the same way that I do. And all that's gonna be done for free. All you gotta do is click that first link below, join that masterclass and you'll be sure to get one of these on that masterclass on that coming Saturday. So I cannot wait to see you there. Hurry up and register quick because I don't know when I'm gonna close the doors on. Over 1,000 people have already registered and I don't want you to get left behind, all right? And I'm gonna get back to work, so come on, let's go.
so it is 4 30 p.m. right now. I had an awesome, awesome afternoon work session building a couple things on the sales operations side of my business, as well as a couple administrative tasks. And right now, it's actually dinner time, man. There's this one restaurant that I went to last week called Wilbur's. It's the best Mexican food I've ever had in Toronto. Very competitive to the Southern Californian Mexican food back down in LA and Orange County and San Diego, where I'm from. But it's probably one of my top favorite restaurants in Toronto right now. So I'm gonna order on my phone and then I'm gonna walk over to Wilbur's to pick up the food. So come on, let's get going. And wish I could have been, I'm never gonna regret the hours I've been putting in. So take a chance on faith. So it is finally warming up here in Toronto. I can't believe I've been living here for about three months now and this is one of the first weeks that we finally hit 70 degrees. But hey, thank you Lord for giving Toronto warmer weather. Let's head over to the restaurant. So we have made it into Wilbur's my personal favorite Mexican restaurant here in Toronto. So let's grab some salsas and we'll get out of here. All right, my friend, check this out. So this is the Wilbur's famous California burrito. I will be the judge of how good this is because I am from California. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Yummy. That's a solid nine out of 10. Super, super good. No look back and wish I could have been. I'm never gonna regret the hours I've been putting in. So take a chance on faith. All right, so dinner is now finished. It's currently 5.30 p.m. And I'm actually gonna be hopping on a one-on-one -on -one coaching call with one of my high performance training program students. And his name is Gabriel. He's a student based out in Italy. And the reason why I'm having a one-on-one -on -one coaching session with him is I actually don't do one-on-ones very often. But every single week I pick one member of training program that's always a go-giver. And a go-giver is someone who I see is going above and beyond and adding value to the lives of others. Always sharing motivational things. Always sharing the things that are working for them that are improving their lifestyle. And Gabriel, very interesting enough, is both a university student and an entrepreneur. And in this year, he ended up growing his Instagram account to over 50,000 followers. And he shared exactly how he grew his Instagram account. I'm gonna put that post right here of him being such a go-giver. But that strategy he shared to all the other 100 students in the program. And so I wanted to reward him with a go-giver award, which is a free 30-minute one-on-one coaching call. And Gabe, I'm so proud of you, man. In the High Performance Training Program, you've literally saved well over 10 hours of your work week through applying the high performance training program strategies I showed you. So man, you add value, you work hard, and you deserve it. So come on, let's hop on this coaching call right now. What is going on, Gabe? I just wanted to congratulate you for, for being the, the one selected for the one-on-one -on -one coaching call. Thank you so much. Well, same for me, of course, how much, how much way more value you added to my life than the other <laughs> way around, of course, but you don't even, I don't even need to tell you that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. first like, communication skills which we were talking last time as well yeah I think. man to grow any kind of business you have to understand how to sell everything involved in business is getting people to see your point of view oh man so we just had such an awesome awesome coaching call and conversation hey Gabe if you're watching this I just want to let you know your heart of generosity your heart of how much you care about your family and your community, it warms my heart. Essentially, Gabe and I, we strategize a couple of things on the business side of things because he's also an entrepreneur himself. We were talking about the importance of sales strategy as well as how do we set the right expectations with our team members when it comes to balancing family with business. And man, what an awesome coaching call. I absolutely love spending time with the students in the high performance training program. And right now it's 6 p.m. and I actually just have a couple more things to do today before I wrap it up. My hard stop every day is always at 7 p.m. before I start winding down to get ready for the night and I really hope that this 5 a.m. productivity morning routine video serve you all and come on if you haven't registered for the high performance masterclass that's happening on June 20th what are you waiting for it's gonna be such a valuable session and so many people have already signed up I don't want you to miss out let's get you to shave off 12.5 hours of your work week how awesome is that gonna be right I can't wait to see you on that masterclass link is down in the description below and until next time stay sharp stay focused and go crush it.